Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to Crypto Educate channel. Your support means the world to me, so please smash that like button, drop a comment, share this video, and make sure to watch till the end. Your engagement helps us grow and brings more exciting content your way. Don't forget to join my Telegram channel for legit crypto updates and airdrops. Listen, I won't force anybody to join my channel. I won't message you personally or tell you to do anything illegal. You are all important to me. Remember, this video isn't financial advice, so always do your own research. Without any further ado, let's get down to business. Let's start with the Pi Network. This project has been a topic of much anticipation and debate in the crypto community, primarily due to its repeated delays in launching the main net. The latest update indicates yet another delay pushing the launch into 2025. This has understandably left many users frustrated, especially those who have been loyal to the project since its inception. The Pi Network recently issued a crucial reminder for all users to complete their Know Your Customer verification process. There's now a 75-day countdown to fulfill all main net checklist steps by December 30th, 2024. This deadline is crucial because failing to complete the QIC process could mean forfeiting your Pi tokens. Despite the anticipation and excitement, the delays and the push for KYC compliance highlight the network's commitment to regulatory standards and security. However, this extended timeline and the pressure on users to comply could lead to further dissatisfaction. The Pi Network's development team needs to address these concerns transparently to maintain user trust and confidence. The importance of the QIC process cannot be overstated. KYC helps prevent fraud and ensures that the network complies with international regulations. By verifying the identity of users, Pi Network aims to create a secure and reliable environment for its participants. However, the pressure of completing this process within the set timeline, coupled with the threat of losing assets, adds to the user's frustration. The project has also been criticized for its lack of clear communication. There's now a 75-day countdown to fulfill all main net checklist steps by December 30th, 2024. This deadline is crucial because failing to complete the KYC process could mean forfeiting your Pi tokens. Despite the anticipation and excitement, the delays and the push for KYC compliance highlight the network's commitment to regulatory standards and security. However, this extended timeline and the pressure on users to comply could lead to further dissatisfaction. The Pi Network's development team needs to address these concerns transparently to maintain user trust and confidence. The importance of the KYC process cannot be overstated. KYC helps prevent fraud and ensures that the network complies with international regulations. By verifying the identity of users, Pi Network aims to create a secure and reliable environment for its participants. However, the pressure of completing this process within the set timeline coupled with the threat of losing assets, adds to the user's frustration. The project has also been criticized for its lack of clear communication. Users have expressed their dissatisfaction on social media platforms, calling for more transparency from the Pi Network's development team regarding the main net launch timeline. This sense of urgency and the potential consequences for non-compliance have heightened tensions within the community. Now let's talk about the current state of the Pi Network's token. As of now, the real-time price of Pi is $42.29, with a trading volume of $303,608 in the last 24 hours. The price has dropped by 2.36% in the past day, but has increased by 12.83% or cent. Despite these fluctuations, the current market capitalization of Pi is $0, with a maximum supply of 100 billion Pi coins and no coins currently in circulation. Pi's market rank stands at 2,130, with its price today being 87.21% below its all-time high and 23,474.74.4% below its all-time high and 23,404.4% above its all-time low. The token's price has been in the red for five consecutive days, which has particularly agitated Indian traders who are frustrated by the launch delays. If the price continues to drop, it might test the support levels around the 20-day, 50-day, 100-day, and 200-day EMA confluence near $45. Breaching this support might cause the price to fall to $37, while an uptrend could push it toward the resistance near $50. The relative strength index RSI for Pi token is neutral, scoring 57.85 on the daily charts, indicating a balanced market sentiment. The fluctuating price and ongoing delays have made traders cautious. It's essential to keep an eye on the support and resistance levels and monitor any announcements from the Pi Network team. 
Switching gears to Bitcoin, let's discuss the recent trends and updates. Bitcoin has seen some significant changes, particularly with the Bitcoin Runes protocol. This protocol initially dominated daily transactions post-launch, but has recently seen a decline with Bitcoin reclaiming its network dominance. None of the protocols operating on the Bitcoin network have matched the original Bitcoin in terms of daily transactions for an extended period. Since its launch on April 20th, the Runes protocol consistently consumed the highest bandwidth on the Bitcoin network for several days. It accounted for more than 50% of transactions on 13 separate days, but has not reached this level in over four weeks. This decline indicates a waning interest among users and investors. The initial hype around the Bitcoin Runes protocol led to a significant increase in daily transactions and miner earnings. Since its launch, Runes helped Bitcoin miners earn more than 2,540 BTC in just three months. However, this surge was short-lived. The protocol earned 2,500 BTC in fees within the first two months, but only 41 BTC in the following month, showcasing a drastic change in investor sentiment. This drop in interest suggests that the initial excitement may have been driven by speculative trading and the promise of quick gains rather than long-term utility or value. As the hype fades, Bitcoin has reclaimed its dominance, representing 90% of all transactions on the blockchain. Rune still maintains some presence among other Bitcoin protocols, but its share of transactions has fallen under 9% on average. Despite the decline, some believe that Bitcoin runes and similar protocols may still play a role in the evolution of Bitcoin native decentralized finance DeFi. Rich Rhines, a core DAO contributor building Bitcoin DeFi solutions, suggests that these protocols could be stepping stones towards more sophisticated and widely adopted Bitcoin DeFi applications. Bitcoin started as a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system and evolved into a store of value, protecting $1.5 trillion of wealth the rise of ordinals, token protocols like BRC20s, and now runes indicates a growing desire to add more utility to Bitcoin. Bitcoin's journey from a peer-to-peer -peer electronic cash system to a store of value and now a potential foundation for decentralized finance DeFi has been remarkable. The introduction of protocols like runes and BRC20 shows a continuous effort to enhance Bitcoin's utility. However, the market's reaction to these innovations can be unpredictable. The initial hype often leads to a surge in transactions and value, followed by a period of adjustment where the true long-term potential is evaluated. The regulatory compliance is a critical aspect of the crypto world. Both Pi Network and Bitcoin are navigating this complex landscape. The KYC requirements for Pi Network users highlight the importance of adhering to regulations to ensure security and legitimacy. Similarly, Bitcoin's evolution in the DeFi space will require careful consideration of regulatory standards. Compliance with regulations helps prevent fraud and protect users, but it also introduces challenges, the pressure to complete KYC processes, and the potential consequences of non-compliance can be daunting for users. It's essential for crypto projects to balance regulatory requirements with user experience to maintain trust and encourage participation. One of the key factors in the success of any crypto project is community engagement and transparency. As always, it's crucial to conduct thorough research before making any investment decisions in the crypto space. The market is highly volatile, and understanding the fundamentals of a project can help mitigate risks. Stay informed about the latest developments, monitor market trends, and be cautious of hype-driven price surges. That's all for today's update. Thank you for watching and staying until the end. Your engagement helps us grow and bring more exciting content your way. Please smash that like button, drop a comment, and share this video with your friends. Not financial advice. Make sure you do your research. Stay informed, stay safe, and I'll see you in the next video.